All right, let's talk about IPVS, which stands for IP Virtual Server, which uses the NetFilter framework. It also incorporates Virtual Linux Server, LVS. So the reason we use IPVS is because when using IP tables, it can struggle to scale to tens of thousands of services as IP tables is bottlenecked at 5,000 nodes per cluster. IPVS is uh, specifically designed for load balancing and uses more efficient data structures, so hash tables. I think I might have called it hash mapping earlier, but it was, I was supposed to say hash tables on the right-hand side here, allowing for uh, almost unlimited scale under the hood. If you've never heard of hash tables, um, we describe it in crypto, uh, cryptographical stuff, like I, my SC900 course, we talk about it there. Uh, in the future, QProxy will default to IPVS. I really wanted to get like a nice diagram to show how it works, but I really just couldn't find anything. And the point is, is that you're just gonna end up using it in the future and it's used because of the limitations of IP tables. And that's really all you need to know, okay?